this is not new, that uh, the mainstream media does not listen to whistleblowers. That's a tale as old as time, I'm sure. And it has always fallen upon people outside of the Beltway or corporate America to really point things out, whether it be a comedian as a social critic or a movie being, a, you know, pointing out, um, you know, a civil action or a documentary, what have you. But Jon Stewart really, just through comedy, hits the nail on the head. And it's something people all know about, but then when you see it, comedically especially, you go, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But there, it's no mystery that whistleblowers don't find purchase in the mainstream media. The mainstream media is not there to speak truth to power. It is not there to bring big business down when they do bad things. And, of course, it's not a few bad apples. It is systemic for a reason. The system is rigged. And, and, and we keep having fresh outrage or shock or, like, how can this be? But I'm assuming from Boss Tweed and the Tammany Ring back to... Um, you know, John Adams, the six-part miniseries on HBO, they probably just left out all the corruption. The media seems genuinely shocked. I mean, you could say a lot about Jim Cramer and his personality, but I don't think he is disingenuously taken aback. It's telling how out of touch he is that he feels like, oh my God, how dare you indict anyone here at this network as this crisis happens. And the problem, of course, is the financial crisis is also a media crisis. And we've had a large chunk of the media go along with many of these stories. Columbia Journalism Review had a piece out this week looking at coverage of the GAO report on derivatives, a two-year study, exhaustive, raised all kinds of alarm bells. And they went back through in the 90s and showed, with the exception of one great article in Fortune magazine and one guest op-ed by Senator Byron Dorgan, the entire traditional print media, let's leave cable out of it, went along and said, this is scare tactics, they took the industry line, they didn't go in. I'd, I'd recommend anyone check out that story. And the problem is, we were getting the wrong information from much of the media.